A pristine stretch of coastline that also comes with a warning. It's been almost a year since Gold Coast surfer Rob Pedretti was fatally mauled by a shark, Salt Beach on New South Wales' north coast. The attack last June had a massive impact. I stood on this very same spot almost 12 months ago after the death of Mr Pedretti and there was a real sense of shock and, and horror and fear. We, we had been immune from shark attacks, unlike some of our neighbours further south, and I think it was a feeling that the honeymoon was over. Since the attack, surveillance measures, including drones and listening stations, have been implemented along the Tweed Shire coast. But Councillor Owen says despite the eyes in the sky, there's still a lot of nervousness in the community. The local Kingscliff Board Riders Club has seen half the number of young surfers wanting to compete in competitions this year because of the fear of going into the ocean. Parents are very nervous about letting their children into the water and a lot of people are just nervous. All beaches between Newcastle and Wollongong have shark nets and tagging, while Ballina and Richmond Valley Councils have smart drum lines. Councillor Owen believes trialling smart drum lines further north would help ease the public apprehension. There's a bit of frustration and there's fear out there from the community. We're in shark season now, the mullet are running, the whales are migrating and people are concerned. New South Wales Agriculture Minister Adam Marshall and Tweed MP Jeff Provost discussed installing drum lines after Mr Predetti's death last year. But there are still no drum lines in sight. The New South Wales Department of Primary Industries has been waiting on results of a Shark Smart survey due late June. Both Adam Marshall and Rob Provest have been contacted for comment. A spokesperson for the minister said the New South Wales budget would be handed down at the end of the month and if there was any funding allocated for smart drum lines in the Tweed Shire, it would be announced then. Georgia Simpson, Sky News.